Hello, hello everybody. And I thought I'd talk about breeding plecos, bristlenose plecos. And I've, I've had some breed before for me over there in my pond. I never really did anything to cause it. But now I'd like to breed him on purpose. So, this big guy, he's been living in here pretty much ever since I started the tank. And we found a couple girlfriends for him, this being one. And from what I know, they are cave breeders. That's common knowledge everywhere on the internet. So, I've got some of these. Attack those caves and I'm afraid he might be a little too big for these caves, but I'll put them in there. I'll put a couple in there. And I have another tank that I'll talk about. Where I have what appears to be a female. And we found a young male. Now whenever I see these pluckos, you see he's down in there kicking up all that crud underneath the moss. I thought I'd put a cave down in there, in that area. Cause that's where I always see him. You see that big pile, he's always in there digging. Making a mess of stuff. So, I'll put a cave down in there. And over here. In this tank. We have a, we had an existing female and we caught a male and put in there. And we'll put a couple caves in there to see if we can get anything going there. Okay, so. Okay, excuse the technical difficulties there. We had a problem with the camera acting up. So, I had, it again, I had an existing female in here and caught a male out of the pond. And we'll put some caves in there. But if we get some breeding action going. So let's see what we got. Here's what I'll be using as caves again. Let's see what we're doing with them here. Yeah, that's pretty decent size. I wanna give these a quick rinse off in water then we'll place them in the tanks. So we can get some pleco breeding. Yeah, okay, for starters, we'll put this cave down in this tank. Let's see, I need to light out of the way. And We'll see if we can get it down in here. Not tearing up stuff too bad. There's a big old rock. But, uh, okay. Hopefully, 
that's not too bad of an eyesore for the tank. And the plecos. I'll use it. So I'll get this moss mat. Down, there we go. That'll work. Looks like he's already had a cave dug out underneath that rock in there, but anyway. Looks like the shrimp are checking it out. Alright. See how that does. Now. Put one in here. Oh! Let's see if we can find these plecos. There's one there. And I'll see the other one just right now. But we'll put one in here. Oh, he just freaked out. There we go. Hopefully they use it. And the cat's in the way. Yay. Okay, we go. Hopefully they'll utilize that cave. And then I know... This pleco here in the guppy tank, or guppy tank, they're all guppy tanks. Here in the panda guppy tank, I know is going to be a male. There is a male. And we'll put a cave in here so for when we do catch him a girlfriend. He already had himself a nice cave. And that gives us one more. And I'm not sure where we'll put this one. But. Hell. I don't know. Hmm. Where else could we put this one? Well, I'll put one in here for now. Do you know there's already a breeding colony? I'm sure they wouldn't mind having a nice little cave to use. There we go. There's a cave. So, cave there, because we know this one has a male. And it, we just gotta find him a girlfriend. Put him there with him. This one had an existing female. And we put a female in there. And then over here. We've got the great big white male. Oh, I'm not happy with how that's sitting in there, though. Let's see what we can do about that. Alright, I'm not crazy about that. There we go. Oh, it's not looking that good. What the hell? There we go. Like that. We gotta get this moss looking somewhat respectable again. Okay. But far, I still want this tank to look nice, so I got the cave in there. 
like that. You can still get in there. Okay. So hopefully, we'll have some success of breeding plecos. Thought they had their little caves. Hopefully we'll get lots of baby plecos in these tanks eventually. So, you know. Breeding plecos on purpose. Never done it before. Wish me luck. Thank you for watching. Bye.